Hey guys, welcome back for an episode of Pokemon Ranger for the Nintendo DS. So today we're going to be visiting Professor Hastings in um, in Fall City. He said he wants to give us an update on something, so we're going to go and pop and do that. And it's right in here. It's been a while since we've actually seen him, so let's go and see what he has to say. What up, Professor Hastings? What do you got to say? Ah, Daco, very good, to, good, good for you to visit. The Ranger record feature I added to your stylus, do you like it? Is it useful for your Ranger activities? It actually is, yes. Why don't you spend the night here? I'm hoping to get a detailed account for you. Sure, why not? Ah, very well. Let me hear your your tales of adventure. Daku, do I see a captured friend with you? It wouldn't be fair keeping a wild Pokemon captured whilst whilst you and I chat. But it's a Regice, man. You've probably never even seen a Regice. It would be best if you release your friend Pokemon before we begin our chat. Bye bye, Regice. I've got I've got to release him. God damn, everyone wanted to keep him, but bye, Regice. You were great. The one episode I had you. Oh, bye bye. What up, Hastings? What are you got to say, Alan? Daco, what is it? We spend the night here? Yes, and I'll talk about my experience. Yes, very well. Let's not waste any time. Tell me what situations did you experience while in the field? Beg your pardon? I'm not rushing you to out to, am I? Haha. <laughs> pardon me. Rather false of me. The night is long and it's still day. We can talk later on. So let's go to sleep and have a little chat. What's that? Hmm, I see. Haha. <laughs> that sounds implausible. I see, I see. I caught red ice and everything. Yeah, I did, yeah. Daco, good morning. I quite enjoyed our chat last night. Thank you very much. Good morning. Hello there. Daco, Joel was looking for you. He said he had a new mission that he wanted you to handle. He wanted you to see him right away at the ranger base. Could there be some trouble, perhaps? Daco, pay me no mind. You're needed at the ranger base immediately. Do drop by for visits, my friend. You're always welcome here. So, yeah, this is going to be the last... Well, the last arc of missions in the game. What up? How you doing, Joel? Daco, I'm glad you came. I have a mission that I want you to do. Strange that things have been happening in the Safara Sea lately. For, for instance, even though the barometer has held steady, there have been violent waves and abnormal tides. Pokemon that normally live in the sea have come ashore in great numbers too. We also received more alarming news. The lighthouse there has suddenly gone dark. Unfortunately, what's causing these strange occurrences remain unknown. Is it going to be the unknown or is it actually just unknown? Who knows? I want I want you to accompany Arya to the port and get to the bottom of this. I said I don't need any help with this, you know. But our leader said to wait for you, Daco. Okay, I thought she was going to be a bit stubborn there. I'm banking on your keen sense of intuition, Arya, and Daco's capture expertise. Without one or the other, it will be a very difficult mission to take care of this mission. So let's make it official. This is your mission. Go immediately to the port and investigate the strange occurrences in the Safara Sea. And with that, we was assigned a new mission. Getting that. There was no, not, not even like any... There was no mission start screen. There's a lot of mysterious swirling around this mission. But I'm sure you two will, will just manage fine. Okay, dog. So we're going to go into the port. I'm guessing this is... Oh, we're here already. And it's a special mission. Search the, the Safara Sea. What up, dog? Ahoy Rangers, I've been waiting for you. The lighthouse went dark without any warning. The way is now, ships that pass in the night can't sail safely. I went into the lighthouse basement to investigate, but it was like, well, it shivered my timbers. I don't rightly recall their name, but the basement was full of them. Like, a lot of those squirmy things that look like stars. If you want to know what I think, I'd say those things are behind things. So Rangers, what, what can you do for us? You can go into the basement this way. Okay, so it looks like we're going to go into the basement and capture the star use. It was like, it's a bit scared. Okay, let's go in. There can't be that many star use, can there? Let's, let's have a look. I'm pretty sure we brought a star you here in the first place, which actually light up the area. Oh, look, there's some... How can we see through a wall, by the way? Ew, what's that? It's full of star you. How we capture them so they can be calmed down? Okay, it's only a star you, guys. Come on, it's only a star use. Not that bad. And, and attack me. Okay, we're going to be fighting four star use to start the episode off. Jesus Christ. Okay, this is fine. Star use are fine by me. Okay. I, I really don't like star use because they are pretty annoying. We have got our partner Pokemon if needed, which I don't really want to use, but if we have to do, we can do. Okay, star use are annoying. Like, just look at this. I, I can't even get spin around them. Oh, for God's sake, star use, come on. Come on. Like, I feel like they put so many here just, just to get in the way. Like, honestly, it's just to make you annoyed. Get balls of using our partner Pokemon. We're not wasting time here. Star use are pretty easy to capture. We'll just shock them all to death. We'll get half of them, and then the other half will be pretty easy to capture. Yeah, there we go. We've got half of them. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell? Okay, there we go. There we go. Let's just capture this one. Okay, get some more experience. I want to actually farm some some more 
party Pokemon bar here. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep spinning this guy to fill up our bar. Because why not? You know, get, get some more more bar up. You know, I'll see you guys when we get it full. And there we go. We've got a full bar and we've captured all of the uh, star A Pretty easy capture to be honest. I had to use my, part, my partner Pokemon because I didn't want to waste too much time. But be free, Staryu. Bye-bye, friends. Hope you calm down a little bit now. Now what, Aria? And is that really the end of the mission? Do we really just complete the mission? We can't have. It was a style that caused the lighthouse outage. I guess we're finished here. Let's go and head out. Sounds like a plan to me. Okay. And eek, help, help. Um, what the hell? Daco, that screaming came from the toy center. I know, let's run in. Oh my god, what's actually happening in here then? Oh my god, what's with all the Pokemon going rampant? Jesus Christ. Um, oh, oh, please, Rangers, help me. A whole tour bus of Krabbies is running amok. They keep waving and clicking their snippers about. It's so scary. I balled at my fist and tried to engage them with rock, paper, scissors, but they're not having any of it. Oh no, my one weakness, rock, paper, scissors. Let's capture them and return them to the sea. Okay, okay, so it looks like a lot of war-based Pokemon are actually going a bit a bit crazy. I, I don't know why, and also with the whole wave system, with all, loads of Pokemon, war-based Pokemon actually landing on like the actual bed of the sea. It's getting, it's getting annoying, isn't it, for like, actual sailors and stuff. It's getting dangerous more than anything, if you think about it. Okay, these crabbies are a lot easier than, than the other Pokemon. Oh, and I say that and I got hit by a crabby, but okay, I, I'm pretty sure this is going to be annoying because these guys are hitting pretty hard. Like, they're not hitting hard, but it's like the more you're going to capture, the more damage they're going to do. So it's, quick, it's good to actually just get them out of the way as fast as you can here. Crabbies, you are now free. Thank you, you saved us. My knees are knocking together, but I'm almost back to feeling okay. But well, what is going on? There's so many strange things. I do agree that there's something not right actually in this area. And uh, we, we completed another mission, well, a sub-mission, I guess. So so now what? Have we completed the mission, or what's happening here, then? Um, okay. Ah! Ah! What the hell? What was that? What was that showing? It's coming from, it came from the pier! Okay, okay. Is, is this the pier? I think it is. Would you look at that? That's what I call a uh, sort of situation. Those Pokemon are called car something. I think it was. They're not what you, you expect to see around here, but normally... Oh, it's Carvanas. No! What are they doing now? What are these Carvanas doing up here? They seem very agitated too. What's happening in the sea to make them behave like this? Anyways, you better capture them so they can calm down. Something's seriously not right. Not right in the slightest with all these Pokemon. There's like so many about. So many. This is not safe. Like, also, Carvanas are pretty easy to capture, to be honest. Three spins, you know. There we go, caught one of them. Uh, one match got, got all like, caught in our loop then, which I didn't mean it to happen, but it did. Okay, um, fine, let's say. Come on, Carvanas. Yeah, there we go. Pretty easy to capture. The thing that's making it difficult here is how many there is. There's not just like one Carvana, there's like four, which makes it difficult and we're quite a bit experience for that, to be honest. Well, me, you're something special. You have my thanks. But it makes me wonder, why are we seeing all these weird things happen one after another? Yeah, it's a bit weird how it's not all happening at one time. They're all happening like as a series of things. I wonder. But there we go. We caught it. Get in there. What's this? What? Deco, look. Over there, whirlpools. Look how many there are. That can't be possible. What? I can't see any. I can't. Oh my. Oh my God. How many? Jesus Christ. There's like, there's literally like 20 of them. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Um, um, can we use the Lapras, maybe? Oh, that's not a bad shout. Daco, didn't you say that you can communicate with that Lapras? I think you can get close to those whirlpools if you catch a ride on the Lapras. I'll stay here at the port to protect the citizens from harm. Sure you will, sure you will. Daco, please go out on the Lapras and investigate those mystical, uh, the mystery, uh, mysterious whirlpool. I can't say mysterious. You, you, know, you, you know the word I'm trying to say. I can't say it for some reason. It's just one of those words I can't say. But, oh my god, we're in a whirlpool. How are we not spinning here? Oh my god, there's, a, there's an even bigger one. Oh, we're trying to get away. No, swim away. Swim away. I'm just going to get pulled straight back. Yep, I thought so. The whirlpool power is too strong. This is not good. Oh no, we're going down. We're going down. It's like Titanic all over again. I won't let go, Jack. Oh, oh see, me and uh, me and Jack still together. That's what I'm going to call Lapis and Jack. Thank God. Thank God. So we're, we're in the ocean. And, oh my god. Oh my god, is that what I think it is? Is that... It's Kyogre. There appears to be vicious bite marks on his back. It's... The only thing that could, could inflict wounds like that would be Groudon. Kyogre must have encountered its arch rival Groudon somewhere and engaged it in battle. The mysterious whirlpools appear to be made of the thrashings of... 
The mysterious whirlpools appear to be made by the thrashings of the Kyogre. Oh my god. Kyogre. Wait, wait, don't set. Oh my god, we're going to capture a Kyogre. It's a wild Kyogre. Oh my god, I love Kyogre, by the way. We will be using our Pokemon build here. But it looks like Groudon is causing trouble. Groudon, god damn you, Groudon, your antics. God damn it. Oh, it's pretty... That was that was a pretty easy capture for a Legendary, to be honest. I thought Kyogre would be a lot more difficult. But yeah, we, we caught Kyogre. That should calm down the situation. That is added to our Pokedex, which is one of the Legendary Pokemon we were missing, which is always good. And now Kyogre, be free. Be calm. Don't meet Groudon again, because he's bad, he's bad news bears. Also, how are we going to get out of there? How do, we, how do we get out of the Whirlpool there? Is it just me? I have no idea how we got out. Oh, Daco. Oh my god, you're safe. I am so relieved. It's been so long since you were swallowed up by those Whirlpools. I thought maybe... I even teared up a little thinking about it. I shouldn't have worried. We was gone like five seconds if that. Oh, wait a second. I'm kidding, of course. I didn't cry. You really don't think I'd cry, but that's not important. What happened when you was down there? I encountered a Kyogre. You would not believe. And it was anger. Yeah, Kyogre. Those Whirlpools were made by a Kyogre. And those Whirlpools made all the other Pokemon misbehave abnormal abnormally. But the Whirlpools are gone now. Does that mean Kyogre's wounds are healed? Well, I don't think they're healed. I think it just calmed down a little bit. Gee, Daco, that is fantastic. Let's go back to the range base and file a report with our leader. FAB. That was actually a really good thing. I really like that. I can't believe how quickly we caught Kyogre, to be honest. I thought it was going to be a lot harder. Daco, Aria, great work from the both of you. I just got word from a sail in the port that the sea has definitely calmed down. He is definitely grateful. Daco, got the job done. I wish you could have been there to see it yourself, leader. Of course, last part all took place under the waves, so I didn't actually know exactly what happened either, but Daco appears to have discovered what was causing the recent troubles. Apparently it was Kyogre. It was in agony from injuries sustained in a battle with an unknown enemy. Well, it was Groudon, wasn't it? It had to be Groudon. You say, the legendary Pokemon Kyogre? If that's the case, there's no doubt in my mind that his opponent was Groudon. Their colossal battles have been well documented in Legends for, from long ago. But who could have imagined that their battles would repeat would be repeated now? In, the, in this day and age. Kyogre must have come to the floor region to heal its wounds. Do you think uh, this is based directly after the Gen 3 games where Kyogre, Groudon and Rayquaza has a massive fight and they all retweet, re retreat to one area which happens to be the floor region? I don't know, maybe it is. Whatever the case may be, the mission has unexpectedly given us a new theme for studying Pokemon. Ariana, uh, Aria and Daco, you have cleared your mission with flying calls. Great work, you two. And with that, we complete the mission. We're not going to get any upgrades because we are max rank. But uh, boom, bam, the secret mission number one complete. Well, I'm glad that's over. And Daco, I'm glad you're safe too. Uh-huh. Daco, did you say something? Uh, in the port, I was crying. Um, what are you talking about? I didn't I didn't do anything crying. What, what are you saying? What are you saying? All I'm saying is that if you go, if you were to go away, I wouldn't feel so pressured at work to work harder. That's all. Cry over you, Daco. You've got to be joking. Oh, she loves us. Ha 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 ha. It's as if you two were Kyogre and Groudon. Even though you haven't seen each other in a while, you instantly meet and you're already bashing each other. <laughs> I hope none of us innocent bystanders get caught up in, in your squabbling. Just like the Staryu and the Carvana went through this time. Haha. <laughs> ah, fun times, you know, and oh my god, mine is so happy. And with that, we have completed the first secret mission. And there's two more and there's a secret special mission, which we will be doing over the next few episodes. So, if you enjoyed this video... Please give a like, I'm going to appreciate it, I don't know what's going to happen now, we're probably going to have to go back to see Professor Hastings, but uh, yeah, we call a new Legendary today, I shall see you guys next time for more Pokemon Ranger for the Nintendo DS, where we're going to be going after another Legendary, I'll see you guys then, peace.